Android 18 in Goku's clothes. Does Krillin know about this? <sighs> I'm telling! Alright, we are back on Hero Coliseum, and these are the new city battles, and hopefully these are actually a challenge for once. I'm pretty sure I already heard that they're not that challenging, which actually really sucks. What are you holding in your hand? So you don't even know what these are. These are our new challenges? Well, I mean, for somebody who has no idea what Hero Coliseum is, level 52 is not bad. But, at this point of the game, why are we even facing these fools that are lower than 99? Why? It, it makes no damn sense. <laughs> so we're going to do the double Vegeta Blue again. I love this freaking deck. We're just going to we're gonna go through maybe two or three, maybe even four of these free battles. Because I feel like they're going to go by really fast. Okay, he doesn't have anything too interesting, so nothing too crazy going on here. We're just gonna go for the one shot. It, it. I mean, these free battles—they've been kind of free, but oh, not the free battles. These city battles, and while we're at it, <laughs> the free battles too—they're not that challenging. It's like, ah, I don't even know what to say about these battles, man. They're too damn easy. It's better than nothing, though. I'll give them that. It's better than nothing. I did enjoy the story mode, so it would have been nice to have more story. But that hasn't happened in a while. But these free battles and city battles, they're just they're not challenging. It's once you get the pattern down, because they have a pattern. They kind of... Well, I'm not going to say they have a pattern. They do randomize it a little bit. But once you figure them out, it, it's really easy to beat all of them. It's really easy to come up with a strategy that's like a guaranteed win every single time. And you have stuff like this, like Vegeta Blue, that is a guaranteed win every single time on em almost every single battle. Have I lost a battle? Ah, yeah, I have lost <laughs> a battle using this deck. Alright, so um, we might as well just... Yeah, we're gonna switch it up. I was gonna just do the solo Vegeta again, but what if he puts three on the left two columns and then just takes me out? <laughs> that would be so embarrassing. <laughs> so let's just play it safe, cover up everything, and let second Vegeta Blue take him out. Because he's gonna hit just as freaking hard. It's kind of crazy. 300! 300! I gotta stop doing that. I've had times where I've screwed myself over <laughs> going for 300 and then all of a sudden they go for 100 and I end up going first. Yeah, we're just gonna skip all this because this is just... This is just sad. <laughs> These city battles are just sad. We got more important things to worry about. So let's get this out of the way, go back to the more important things. I was supposed to do a, a video on Vegeta Blue Evolved on one of them, but I haven't had the time to grind the XP. I was going to make a video of me just grinding the XP. As boring as that sounds. It wouldn't have been as boring as I'm making it sound, trust me, but it would have been boring. <laughs> so It would have been that boring, but it would have been boring. Like this battle just now. Good gracious. So we're going to move on to the next one. Hopefully we get something. We're going to keep going until we get something interesting. We are on a mission right now. We are on a mission to find somebody in this godforsaken city that is actually decent at the game. We're going to go again. Watch him be the final boss. Watch him be the last person in the city battles. It's not going to happen. But it, it would have been cool though to face him and he's like super weak. Where's the next one? There it is. Lego. But it would have been cool to face him, and he's like super weak. Then at the end, he comes back, and he's like, I'm ready to go. And he's got maxed out figures, maxed out level, 50,000 HP. That would just be crazy. That's what I want. I want the... Trunks? It's Trunks. In 40 years. And apparently he's dead, too. Damn. Old man Trunks. I get it. I get it. You're old. You're dead. Life? has clearly not been great to you. But unfortunately, I'm still gonna beat your ass at this game. <laughs> we don't have a choice. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What do you got? What do you got? Come on. Interesting. Okay. It's an interesting team. It's a very interesting team. But I don't see nothing too particularly interesting. Whoa! That was interesting. 0-1 versus 0-1? Maybe I should have checked. 
<laughs> this is this actually is kind of interesting. So either your Frieza beats my Vegeta, or my Vegeta beats you. Uh. Let's go for 300. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> this is, this kind of caught me off guard. I was not expecting a zero one figure in that team. I I should have when I saw that Golden Frieza because we've seen this before with this damn Golden Frieza figure. We've seen this crap before. That was pretty damn good. That was a pretty good hit. But so is this. So is this, my boy. Woo! Get that additional too. Yeah, my baby. Alright, so there's no way in hell we can keep the 01 Vegeta out there, so we're gonna switch out the other one, tag, you're it, you know what I'm saying? And, oh man, that would've been nice though if you would've took him out though. That would've been beautiful. Alright. Go ahead and cover up all the columns. You're gonna do that again? N no, no, no! There, there, there was nothing smart about that! Why? So check this out. What if he thought... I know, it's a computer, he's not thinking, I get it, but, but, what if he thought <laughs> I was actually going to leave my zero one one figure out there, and he was looking to take him out this turn? What if that's, what if, what if, what if he actually did think? Oh my goodness, could you imagine? Damn, he almost took that Vegeta out too, damn. If he would've took him out, oh my goodness, we would've had to... Well, I mean, we would've took him out anyway. <laughs> we have all three columns getting hit. We would've took him out anyway, so I mean... There was nothing smart about that. <laughs> ah, this this battle right here was perfect. It's the epitome of how these city battles usually go. Crazy. I might just end it here. No, because both of those battles kinda sucked. Moving on! Hello, Daphne. You're the third and probably the last of our battles, so please give us something good. Hello? I've heard people talking about that recently. Are you kidding me? You don't know what it is either? What has this game become? Okay, level 78. That's actually not bad. 78 is not bad. Hopefully he's got a deck to match that level of his. He's been around the block, he's seen some things. That's one interesting bandana you got. You, why is Pan's bandana on a little mini Frieza? So anyways, let's see what you got. I want to see an interesting deck coming from a level 78. Oh, this actually does look kind of interesting. This does look interesting. Hello? We are looking at... Prevent them from switching places. It's a lockdown deck. He's gonna try to lock us down. I want, I've always wanted to make a deck. I never got a chance to do it, but I want to make a deck to where when your opponent puts three people out there, you lock them fools down for the entire freaking match, and all he has is three <laughs> figures for the entire freaking match. Ah, that's what I want. So we can't do solo Vegeta because the last thing I need is for them to lock him in place. Then the next turn he's just dead. You know, he's just screwed. And we also can't put solo Vegeta on the next round because his Vegeta is about to lock our Goku down. And in the next round, who knows what's gonna happen. His his freaking Broly is probably gonna lock somebody down. We're probably just gonna keep these three out there for this entire freaking match. See how hard you're gonna hit. What do you got, what do you got, come on. It's not bad, it's not bad. It's gonna hit even harder next time if he comes back out. And now we have the lovely Bikini 18. I freaking love that figure. I love Bikini 18. And I like I like the Bikini figures. I like them. And not because they're in bikinis. Hell, I like Santa Videl. Like, and she's not in no bikini. She's in a big, fat Santa suit. <laughs> so, yeah, it, it ain't the bikinis. They're legitimately bad at This is one of those rare occasions when you can put bikini girls in your team and actually be like, they're actually good. I'm not just trying to make myself some harem. I'm, I'm legitimately building a powerful team. And unfortunately, it seems like the less clothes they have, the more powerful they are in, in this game. That's just the way it is. It's just the way it is. <laughs> Damn, you're going to use the same team? Exact same formation? I, I that's, that's almost as if you locked me down, I locked you down. Like, we just, we just traded without actually trading. I don't even know what I'm talking about right now. I'm just making conversation. I never do more than one match, which 
yeah, I mean, usually my matches or my, my videos are like 10 minutes anyways, and we're like at 10 minutes, so I shouldn't be out of things to talk about, but I feel like I am, so I'm just ranting on right now. You're going to hit him even harder by, didn't he do like 3,800 last time? Never mind then. So once I get some free time, I've been hella busy. My job's been making me work freaking overtime like a mother frigger every single freaking day. And that's just getting on my nerves. <laughs> I got things to do. And them keeping me a couple hours later every single freaking day is making it even harder to do the things I gotta do. But anyway, so I'm gonna try to get Vegeta evolved, maxed out. We're about to win, so it's all good. But uh, I'm gonna get him maxed out. I wanna try something with him, something really stupid that's gonna fail, but... I just want to try it because it sounds cool in my head. <laughs> so we're going to try it. This actually went to three rounds. I'm kind of shocked. No, I'm not really shocked because the only reason why the other battle didn't go this far is because of this man right here. Okay, she's not going to hit that hard, so she won't be able to take him out. We're about to take out the master. It's over. Broly looks badass as all oh, hell. <laughs> I love the new Broly. He is so badass. We are not going to go for 300. Or are we? No, we're not. <laughs> I was legitimately looking for it. That would have been stupid. That would have been so stupid if I would have done that. Now, I guess it wouldn't have mattered, because the only one I really need to get the defense is this Vegeta, and he doesn't have defensive second anyway, so yeah, it really wouldn't have mattered. Damn, that was kind of dramatic. Jesus! <laughs> that was a really dramatic explosion. Look how sick Broly is, though. You ain't taking... Okay, never mind. I'm so stupid. I was just about to say, you ain't taking out Whis, my boy. He took him the crap out. <laughs> oh, man. All right, all right. We are done here. That is three of the city battles. I wonder how many there is. We're going to stop right here, and sometime in the future, we'll finish it off with the rest of them. That was a nice little deck. I actually enjoyed that deck he had. That was actually really nice, so... We got some figure coupons. I need that. This Fidel, though. That'd be cool if it was like Santa Fidel. I know it's not, but that would be cool if they actually gave us some badass figures. We always get some crappy figures as rewards. You know what I mean? It'd be cool to get something badass. Like at the very end on the final battle for these, they should give us something badass for once. For once. Give us something badass. Like some kind of you are. You know what I mean? Reward us for wasting our time. Okay, there's the next one, but we'll do that in the next... Well, well, well. What have we here? Android 18 in Goku's clothes. Does Krillin know about this? <sighs> I'm telling!